Okay, I'm kind of tired and my throat hurts, but Animosity 4, finally, animations, let's see what this madness is about. He did say this was going to get confusing, so pardon me if I do get confused. Car and is this supposed to be the security guard before Michael? This isn't the same song that Whoa! Wait, he's all grown up now. Boy, get a haircut. Also, nice dust particles. Baby. Although, why does the shirt still fit him? Here we go, the mom from Animosity 1. Oh god. William. But he's, isn't he supposed to be in the Springlock suit? Fun time Freddy. And um... Oh, now we're in... Uh, um, Michael, what did you do to that lady? Like someone just dumped him in here. Down, down, below we go. Um, oh, prepare for crashing. Oh, that was quick. Okay, that was cool. <laughs> the ghostly effects. Love it. So is this supposed to be our void scene, representing the mind? Yeah, this is going by really quickly. <laughs> so, he went to visit the mom, or not yet. Again, why is he still wearing that shirt? Oh, we're back here. 30 years later. Okay. Hand off the lady, bucko. Ouch. Um. I would say Henry, but I don't know. Gross. Foxy bro. Um, you better hope um, whatever he did to the mom from Animosity One, you better hope he doesn't do it to um, the one who killed them. Accidentally. Well that was certainly confusing. But holy shoot. That was fun. I gotta be honest, my biggest question about this is actually the mom from Animosity 1. I mean, what was that whole thing in the forest? Was that just your void scene? Where you it represents the thoughts and emotions of one or multiple characters? And again, what did he do to her? Ring the doorbell, say hello, and give her a fright.
She's not dead, is she? Okay, so let me see if I can try to... Let me see if I can try to understand what's going on here. Michael wakes up, but as an adult. So does that retcon the ending of Animosity 3? His hair has grown out. He got the haircut, still... He goes to see the mom from Animosity 1. He goes to sister location, gets scooped. His older brother finds him, which by the way, good job of bringing him back. Okay, so, um, once again I made the mistake of not reading the description before watching. Suddenly things start to make sense and not at the same time. Although that is, although Soul Split, that's interesting. Mid, this story is bizarre, but I like it. Well, that is all. Bye!